Hi, it's Nicole, and today I want to take you to one of my favourite local bookshops located in West Yorkshire in the north of England, more specifically in the World Heritage Site of Saltaire. Although London is one of the capital cities for publishing in the Western world, and it makes sense that so many booktubers are based there, there are also so many other great bookish places in the UK. The main attraction in Saltaire is the old textile mill right next to the river, which was converted into a quaint commercial centre in 1987. It is home to several independent businesses such as an art supplies shop, an antiques shop, art galleries, including a collection of works by world-renowned local artist David Hockney, several eateries, a bike shop, a furniture shop, and even an exhibition all about the Salts Mill and its grumpy Victorian capitalist proprietor, Sir Titus Salt, who established the village of Saltaire. The name of the village, the portmanteau of its founder's surname, and the river upon which the village is situated, the River Eyre. But let's get to the bookshop. It has a fantastic selection, from mainstream novels from all of the major publishers, to poetry, to reference books on crafting or space stations or nature, to self-development books, to children's books, to politics, to works from independent publishers and local authors. And of course, you can get bits and bobs like calendars and postcards and gifts too. As the website says, all minds are generously catered for here. The books in the Read Me section are always changing and have short reviews from staff and customers about the books on display. There's also a Read Me section for kids that has both kids' books and magazines complete with reviews for each. The Salts Mill Bookshop really works with the structure of the building, keeping its sense of history. Juxtaposed vintage and contemporary elements make it cozy and welcoming, but also new and exciting. I love how alive this bookshop always feels. Even on days like this when it's pretty quiet, there's still a buzz and the beautiful books, open spaces for browsing and wide windows to let lots of light in even on cloudy days is great for augmenting that airy feeling of possibilities that being in a bookshop tends to give. There are also several seating areas for friends to wait on you while you decide which 10 books you're getting this week. And I always have to make a quick stop to the round kids' books table, which is my favourite feature of the kids' section. The books are always beautiful and fun. Like most of you, I imagine, I just really love bookshops, and this is one I particularly enjoy being in, and feel an unwarranted pride about it being right in my neighbourhood. It's well curated, and I am always pleasantly surprised and tempted by its wide selection. If you're ever in Saltaire, it is definitely worth a visit.